This I wanna nail sports to the one Top vlog at top YouTube channel No matter which sports here we got it covered Subscribe and hit the notification bell What's up my wonderful sports to the bone family What's up, what's up Welcome back, welcome back to another video Yes man, shout out to all my viewers and my subscribers Big up on yourself So we have a couple of things to take a look at in this one Interesting things my peeps We see where the West Indies white ball captain Nicholas Puran Recently in an interview when he was speaking about the Super 50 tournament He said that they are aware that playing first class cricket will definitely help to develop the batsmen will definitely help to develop the batting skills of batsmen but they don't necessarily have the time to play that so we're going to talk about that plus we see where um the lead selector desmond haynes and jimmy adams they were both um you know doing an interview and they shed some light as to why the squad was selected like that as to why rastan chase was selected why goody kishmoti did not make it and they also shed some light as regards to rakim carnwall and a couple of other players that were in contention for selection so we're going to talk about all of that my peeps just make sure you stick with us until the end and if you have not yet subscribed please go right ahead and subscribe to the channel so we're going to start off with Nicholas Puran first, right? And I am taking this from, a, from an article online here. And I'm just going to read some of it for you. It's a West Indies white ball skipper Nicholas Puran said that playing more first class cricket could help uh, white ball players with their batsmanship, but with a packed and oftentimes hectic international schedule. It is difficult for them to find the time. You hear that? With a pack and hectic international schedule, it is difficult for them to find the time. So only the international schedule I'm talking about, you know. The franchise cricket, the IPL, the BPL, the the, the CPL, what it will, not even CPL. The other T20 leagues. Those are not even up for discussion, you know, my viewers and subscribers. Those are not for up for this cup, um, discussion. Those they definitely will have to play based on what is happening here. So he's saying that based on the pack international schedule, they don't have time to play international, um, to play first class cricket anyway. But we go down into it. They say Puran was speaking to the media in Trinidad and Tobago. Um, just before the Super 50 tournament. And this is what he had to say, and I quote, It's tough. It's extremely tough. A lot of players want to play cricket, but you can't just come back from international series and just go a couple days later into first class game you hear that a lot of players want to play cricket but you can't just come back from international series and just go a couple days later into a first class game all right man them said them tired rasta he went on to say everyone in the world is talking about mental health and it is important to get rest a lot of players are breaking down as well and um, a lot of players are breaking down as well and if that happens then there will be no one to represent West Indies so we need to be careful about that as well. <laughs> Puran also admitted that first class cricket um, definitely helps this is what he had to say and i quote def definitely a bonus but he uh, but it also will um put a toll well it also puts a toll on the body after playing international cricket he says that if you look at the international schedule it has been packed every week there are cricket games so international players can't always play first class cricket we need to take that into consideration and be smart about it as well. And I definitely understand what the skipper is saying. I totally understand what the skipper is saying that with so much um, 
international cricket being played, it is difficult to just step down from the international cricket and just step into first class cricket. You understand? And the worst thing is that you're not making the money that you that you would want to make. So people are going to find it even more difficult. But I'm wondering, how is it that people can hop from international games straight into IPL and, 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 and Big Bash League and can hop straight from those leagues into international cricket? But they can't hop into first class cricket. I guess because it's four day cricket still and um well you, you have the, the super 50 i guess because it's a lower form at the end, you don't necessarily you won't necessarily get out the uh, the money 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 <laughs> anyway poor and went on to say i want to use that hurt as motivation we're talking about the the, the world cup loss right say they want to use that hurt as motivation to come back stronger and to make sure that um he is definitely putting his best foot forward. So that is what um, the skipper has to say, my viewers and subscribers. So quite a few of us as fans, we have been saying that these players need to play for regional cricket, need to play first class cricket. But according to Puran, it is difficult to play in such a packed um, international schedule and then just take a day or two and, and, and go straight into um, first class cricket. And as I said, my peeps, I definitely understand this. These players are not robots, right? So we don't expect them to just jump from international to first class. But, you know, I am wondering how is it that they can jump from international straight to the different uh, money leagues. But yeah, I, I was probably because it's shorter still, you know, the T20 league shorter than Super 50 that they will have to play on and, 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 and regional cricket. So I guess that is the excuse. But that is what the skip had to say, my peeps, that he's definitely aware that playing first class cricket can improve the batsmanship of the white ball players, but they don't necessarily have the time for that. You understand? So... Yeah, they are sacrificing their 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 their, their they, they are sacrificing their development for West Indies cricket. Let's just put it that, that way. They are playing international cricket, so they don't have no time to play first class cricket to develop their sportsmanship, that to develop their batsmanship. So that's how the big man has said my peeps. So make we, make we move on. Right? Um quite a few persons have been um complaining as it relates to why Rastan Chase um is in this test squad. Some people have been asking for Rakim Carnwall, while others have been asking for Gudikish Moti. Now, the lead selector Desmond Haynes and the lead man of, of, of Cricket West Indies, Jimmy Adams, they both were in an interview and I have a couple of things that they said as it relates to why, you know, Rastan Chase was selected and why Carnwall and... um. Moti weren't selected. So let's get straight into it, my peeps. So the first question that I have here, you know, it was asked, why is it that Rastan Chase was selected? And um, how, 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 how did he get in? And based on what Desmond Haynes is saying, Chase was selected based on the panel's decision, right? That is, I can't understand how these people answer questions. You, know, you, you, you ask, how, how was he selected? You're going to say he, he was selected based on the panel's decision. Why not tell us tell us the, 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 the work? Well, you know, let me let me go down in it, yeah, my peeps. So according to him, they decided to go for, 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 for an off spinner. They decided to go for an off spinner, and that is why Rastan Chase was selected, and that is why Goodikish Moti was not selected. So they decided that going to Australia, the off spinner is what they wanted. And they believe that Rastan Chase is the best person to do the job. Right? So it is the well, I apologize. They, they they told us why they selected him. It's based on their belief, right? Not based on the based on the on the, on the numbers that they would have put up in the last regional tournament that they the same one claimed they would be selecting teams from. This is why he was selected, right? We believe we chose Rastan Chase because we believe he's the best person to do that job. Right? So he was they were asked about Rakim Carnwall. And this is what um, I think it was Jimmy Adams that spoke about this part. He was saying that Rakim Carnwall was a part of a group. Rakim Carnwall, Dominic Drakes, and a couple of other players were a part of a group that they needed some more information about. I don't know what type of information, what the secret is about, if it has to do with their fitness or what. But this is what he said. 
the Dominic Drakes, Rakim Carnwell and a couple other players were a part of a group that they needed some more information about. And they waited to announce the squad. They waited until they got that information. And when they got the information, that is when they decided that Rakim Carnwall and the other and and, and so, well Rakim Carnwall wasn't going to be a part and then they went ahead and announced the squad. Don't ask me what information it is, my viewers and subscribers, because I don't know. That is what um, Mr. Mr. Jimmy Adams said, that the Rakim Carnival is a part of a group or a part of a, a, of a, um, well, a part of a group of players that were being considered, but they wanted some more information. So when the information that they wanted co um, came in, they decided that they were going to go ahead and name the, 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 the team and Carnival was not selected in it. So... There you have it, my peeps. I cannot add or take away anything from it. That is what um, Desmond Haynes and um, Jimmy Adams had to say as it relates to the West Indies squad that will be going to Australia. So, yeah, that's pretty much it, my peeps. Big up on yourself. Um, let me know in the comment section what you think about that. Zane.